back on and see what yeah. we can get yeah. on and try to get some more groups involved. Okay. I, I will revise the letter to update it to reflect current dates. Okay. Um, so if we come up with new groups that need a letter sent to them, we'll have that. Okay. Um, July 15th, I believe, was our deadline that we wanted to have people um, respond okay. um, so they could preserve their spots. I do know that um, women's work is going to bring a tent and uh, a lot of literature and things like that. So they were very excited about it. They were on it just like that. It's so, right. so is this the first year of being in it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah. I think so. Yeah. That's great. It so, Shana, we're doing a Marine we have filled you in a little. This is called Club Affair. Mm -hmm. This will be our third time of doing it over the years, and it's to introduce the community to different clubs in the community and organizations and groups they can belong to. And it's also a kind of fundraiser then for Callahan House. And instead of naming a fee that we have to have, for them to rent, rent the space in the house or in the gardens or whatever, we're requesting a minimum donation of $50. So they can donate more if they choose to or less if that's their budget or whatever. So, um, but yeah, we've got, like I said, at least five groups that are definitely um, wanting to pursue this. Mm -hmm. But we need more. Oh, okay, absolutely. We, we need, need at least that. <laughs> we'll do that. And, and Brittany's gonna look into food trucks yeah, she has some thoughts here on that. Okay, um, cool. and she and I met before she left, and she kind of told me she's struggling. She's reached out to a bunch of different food trucks with either no response or unavailability. Um, she is finding that the with a food truck, you have to reach a minimum sales guarantee, um, and it's about um, $1,500. So wow. if they don't get that in the business, then we are responsible to then pay them the supplemental. Um, she said it sounds like that would be fine for our walk, that the, the, the um, amount of people coming through our walk, you'd reach that fee, but maybe not with Club Affair. Mm -hmm. um, so she just wanted to put that out there to you guys, but that's kind of where she's finding and concerned that our walk could be a couple of numbers to cover that cost. I think it would just kind of have a food truck and time and nice. where other people are getting their food at that point. Considerations. Yeah, because there's other places on Main mm -hmm. Right, so. Okay. Just, yeah. That's something that we should consider <coughs> in terms of if we don't go that direction. We talked about having uh, refreshments. Just light mm -hmm. refreshments. Right, light refreshments, mm -hmm. yeah. Like we did yeah. in the past. I think, right. I think that's okay. where we're going to end up. Plan B. So that's just some mm -hmm. ones that I don't think we can do. No, no. Okay. This is a fundraiser. Yeah. Yeah. No. And, 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 and again, um, I had a quick um, <coughs> question, though. If I'm going to be reaching out to the but Latino community, do we want to put the letters in Spanish? Well, that would probably be a, a good idea. Do you think we should do that? Do we have city? Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 Do we have mm -hmm. Okay, I'll update the letter. Um, I'm going to go home right away. And then text yes. it to Brittany or to yeah. 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 me because Brittany's out to first. Told okay. Tomorrow, and, so yeah. I'm sure I have your info in. I can leave it for you, just to be sure. Okay. And then you should do so that to me. Yes. Thank you. That's a good, good thought. Mm -hmm. So we're approaching people and they're feeling more. Right. We're meeting on the right side. Right. Exactly. Right. So hopefully yeah. we could get some more involvement that way. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm thinking. Right. Okay. But we'll just work with the other group. Um, I said that right. Uh, yeah. AUW. Oh, good. Uh, University Women in Colorado right. Mountain Group. Good. Um, I spoke with Westers and they're going to be involved, but I'm, Connie was just moving. Oh. She just moved into her house oh. literally um, a week that ago. So, so Distracted. Um, <laughs> we didn't get it on board, but you know. Okay. Okay. And it, Brittany also has noted here that she's um, sent in a request for a flyer from Citywide Comms. She did it on May 22nd, and as of 6 3, um, Rachel was working on it, but she didn't have one to share yet. Okay. So, those are these flyers that we can take around to yeah, so. um, ask people to put in their windows and on bulletin boards and 
That's yeah. Mm -hmm. Come to our friends that will look at And she may have one in her inbox. Right. Very little version of it. Right. Yeah. 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 And I was just introduced yesterday to, last night, to the new communications director. Uh, and, uh, so that position's been filled, so that might make things easier in the future for some of the right. communications. Good. Okay. Excellent. Okay. Anything else on Club Affair at this point? Okay, let's move on to Club cri Selection Criteria. We have that pretty much put together, I think. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know. They're, all the notes she has here were just what we discussed last time. Right. No, so there's no. So I think we're, we're about ready to mm -hmm. go with that. Okay. Excellent. Um, which leads us right directly to the club survey. Um, I was working on the club survey. Was that the meet? You guys had the meeting after our last time? Yeah. I think it was. It was here. Karen. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Well, let's table that. Um, it's nothing we're going to do anything about any. This is a survey uh, for the club to see how they're using the house and what we can do to make it better, easier, that kind of thing. I, I believe we had hoped to have it approved at this meeting, but without Karen here, right. I don't know. Yeah. No, um, I'm not going there. No, right. And I think it was a survey that was going to be used for the new as well, clubs well. because we've already surveyed those past clubs. Right. So it was to be used for the new clubs and um, also to be looked at that we would do at a future date. Right. And so it's two, not, two year period out. Right. right. Mm -hmm. Exactly. And we paired it way down. Yeah. 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 Page yeah. 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 Which is yeah. great. Which is that makes much people simple. will maybe actually fill it out. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Can I go, I'm so sorry. Can yeah. I go back to club affair? I yes. want to make sure um, I'm doing a good job of you looking are. for pretty. Um, what you, have you guys seen how the club affair, how clubs are signing up? Have we what? Like seeing the Brittany, um, how they're registering for Club Affair. From what I understand, they were calling her. They can call her. There is also, there's also um, a link, like a way to sign up online. Um, she and I put that together and it's active um, through like our recreation through registration. Rec. Um, it's on the same page that they would search to do a Callahan House donation or okay. purchase um, a like a recreation gift card. Um, so when they fill it out, it's uh, formalized that it's their club, the contact information, and then it's a freestanding question of what would you like in your setup or are you requesting anything for setup? Um, and they can make a payment right there. If they want to pay cash or card, or excuse me, cash or check, then um, they would contact Brittany, and all of her information is in the link. I can share this with the group. Mm -hmm. Yes, we yes. have any okay. responses. Yes, yes. would be yes. Yes is the answer. I'm assuming that I mean she had five, so I'm assuming yeah. those are the five you knew about. Oh. Um, mm -hmm. But I mm -hmm. can send the link to the page, it, where at least you would select right where to go. Okay. So there's a couple different, different options. I, I think this might be great if it, if I get um, more people that are used to, to, to a little more technology. I do, I do know that questions <laughs> probably won't. Do. Right. Yeah. Yeah. And I think inherently there will be plenty of clubs who just contact I, I love them, but, yeah. Yeah, but they're a little older they're generation. Yeah. It's they're generational. A little, a little <laughs> more set in their way. Yeah. So the revised letters. That link be included in the I would think so. That's a good suggestion. That's a great suggestion. Yeah. And in that registration, it it allows the person who's signing up to pick the dollar amount. Okay. Um, so whether they want it, it says that we are suggesting fifty, but they can make it zero or they can make it hundred. That's okay. It's very flexible. They can send us a thousand. It would be fine. <laughs> okay. Then we can get a food truck. Then yeah. we can get a food truck and all. Of it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I apologize for. Oh no, no thank you, Griffin. I appreciate that. We just need to get more groups participating. Mm -hmm. right. Really do. I mean, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, five is not. Uh, yeah. Not enough. We've got. It's in not to, No. No, it's in August. No, it's okay. August. It's in August. 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 The deadline was supposed to be like July fifteenth mm -hmm. to get back, but it's time to. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's a 17th. Is that the 17th? Um, yes. I think it's a August. August. Yes. Yeah. Okay. And they've received 
um, snail mail and they've received um, emails of the letter. So there, there were very few that I could not reach okay. with the uh, emails. Okay. Uh, Have we gotten no responses that no American can be involved? I've response? gotten one. Um, I can't remember what the group was. Oh, it was uh, League of Women's Boulder County League of Women Voters. Oh, well, good that they oh, yes. responded. And they did respond. Yeah. But oh. this time they didn't um, didn't have enough people to man the booth. I oh. think was the reason. Yeah, yeah it is. Uh -huh. Do that. It's kind of yeah. 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 yeah, that's right. That's <laughs> uh -huh. what I thought. Yeah. 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 Okay, we might reach out to them anyway. All right. Okay, uh, anything else on those that we kind of... Uh, I'm sorry. I I'm not trying to rush through these. No, I just, no, it's just my fault. I thought I thought of something at the last minute. So, that's cool. we're, All right. so where are we at? Patrons we are down program? to patrons program. Mm -hmm. Okay. Again, I know that I've been working on that with, with uh, Karen and Cindy, and I thought we were to the point that we could approve that and move that off, but I will not do that without Karen here at Health Um Where so there's a program outline and then there's an invite letter um, that I'm going to draft before our July committee meeting okay. so that you guys can look at it. Do you have a committee meeting set for July then? I think so Karen was going to set one up. I don't, I don't have anything on your calendar. calendar. I have nothing on my calendar. Okay. Either. So to check with Karen. Okay, uh, that patron program, Sean, just for you, uh, is it's like Friends of the Library. Right, right, right. Makes patrons the county. No, I, I see that. I was I was going to try to figure out where the best place is. It's not the spot, I think, to talk about what we heard from uh, Sarah Leonard from Visit Longmont, but uh, it might be. Um, during your uh, items from the board, uh, but it seems like maybe that's another way of getting people to to look at <coughs> your what you have to offer here. Mm -hmm. People that are coming in to visit and the people that are here that they're visiting mm -hmm. all of a sudden realize, oh my goodness, this, this is a great fit. So I don't know if that that's why I mentioned it here at your patrons program. Okay. All right, that's something to tuck away. And I'll explain more about it. Okay, when we get there. All right, sounds good. Uh, so just else? for notes for reading, yeah, is, will you guys plan to set up that meeting? Before? Yes, I'll, I'll contact Karen and we'll, we'll work it out. You and Cindy and yeah. Lori. Yes, please. Okay, uh, let's move on to the auto house revamp. Um, Brittany might have something to say about that. Yeah. Her notes know? say that the preference is, have to, is to have a new storage east of the back door. The garden shed can be moved for repointing without needing to be permanently moved. Interior auto house storage quoted at $10,000. Mm -hmm. um, so it's, again, these are her like really right. short little notes. Right, right, right. Exactly. Um, but she That's and I walked really around outside the other day and we're just looking at. Um, Kind of what would be the best option um, and it sounds like she said it sounds like we could move that for the work that needs to be done but since it happened so infrequently that it would be the best to leave that there and build a new shed on the on the pavement patio um, to support the storage of the tables and chairs without doing the auto house Whole thing, which is which is I think when we walked through it, we had talked about that we really didn't feel comfortable putting it within the other house itself because it it limited your space amount. Oh, yeah. It was just the ice machine. Just okay, like, it really um, ate into the space. Yes, it really sure. ate into the space, and with that additional cost amount, I think we'd be in the long haul be better to put it in that space that we have available right. um, on the patio and have ease of getting things in and out. Um, I think that's a better option. Yeah, the first 10000 would have been if it were inside the auto house. We were remodeling the auto house. Oh, okay. Yeah, the interior. Yeah. Okay. 
I guess I'm doing it outside. Did you guys look into that? Because I would think we it would probably be six or seven. To get a, yeah, yeah, just based on what we did, what we did just did at Union with the, okay. with the lifeguard and having sheds built there. And okay. Some little test of working on them. Okay, well, it's still less than 10. Um, so right, it's less than 10. The static is our. Yeah, that's, yes. that's the yeah. key here. Yeah, and we were looking at it. It is kind of still tucked away because my concern was if it was going to be in the way of like photos and things. But with the all the greenery, you can't really see it. So right where we we're looking at, mm -hmm. possibly even moving the other shed, I don't think that's going to be a problem. Yeah. Okay, so I'll let her know that she can kind of start exploring some and options. It, and the other thing that I thought was was wise, and again, this is just my personal opinion, but with the concrete already there. We don't have to put additional walkways or padding. We're worried about mm -hmm. that we're going to be destroying the right. grassways or piping or something along those lines. So, yeah. yeah, it seems like a, a relatively simple solution to it, really. And maybe less expensive. Of course, my mind goes immediately at all the people. They have those little sheds. They have those little sheds. I don't know. Sure whatever. Whatever. Okay. Well, that, and if you've ever driven by 66 and Main Street constantly on that corner, there are some. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Isn't that true? <laughs> was the one at Union, like, no, that's funny. Place? No, no it was like, okay. Yeah, yeah so, nice. Okay, good. So that's the, at least we've got a model there to look at. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Molly and work. Yeah. Got to change. And I think the question might go to if, if we go ahead that direction, um, not immediately, but no. the the auto house inside. The do we want to do anything in there? As far as, I mean, the storage that's in there is not like original stuff. No. It's not pretty. No. Um, I don't know how much purpose it serves right now, especially if we go if we're going this direction. So it's just something maybe down a little bit down the road we can talk about it. In, is there something else we want to do in there to make that just a more appealing place? I think that was one of the discussion points that possibly just removing it because yeah. it's, it's non functioning. Could be as simple as that. It, it, it's, it's not original to build and, and up, update it and, and update the wall so it's a more usable space. Right. Period. Yeah. And if it's just that, then that's, that's great. But I that, think that, I think that was great. one of the discussions that we went in there. And, you know what? It's not. Uh, Good looking area. It's and, really not all and, pretty. and if it's not being used, then you know, maybe we eliminate it. Yeah. Yeah. And like you say, make it a more welcoming, comfortable spot to yeah. have meetings yeah. and things. Okay. Uh, anything else on that, anybody? We're going to move right down to the past and present fall, uh, the board T, fall T. Uh, Again. Yeah, Karen took the lead on that. She, she handles handles the invitations and everything. She does. The last we discussed is that um, we would all pitch in with um, mm -hmm. with doing the the food for for the presentation. I had um, when we last met, I had tracked down a uh, professional musician to um, possible that would donate his time, and he is goes all over the place and does concerts and um, he would be willing to donate his time to play and do a recital on the piano. On the new piano. Yeah. Now the big issue, he is a he is a professional musician. He doesn't want to do background music and I understand that he would like to do a presentation. Mm -hmm. So if we're going to do that, that would be eating into the tea. That's something that I think we're still in discussion point. That yeah. we don't want to eat too much into the tea. Mm -hmm. I mean, is it right. is this something that we can all have refreshments and sit down and listen to the music program and then go from that? I'm not sure. We're still up in there. Yeah, but the fact that he was willing to donate his his um, fee and he already works. Um, well, with the, the person that already does the um, pianos, Fred, and I'm sorry I'm blanking on his last name, um, that restores the piano. So, Fred, yeah, yeah. I'm Fred. So, um, that's all I know. Okay. okay. Well, it's, and so, it's out there in little ways. We don't have to make that decision today. I mean, it's well, I pretty soon. How long do you want to perform for? That's right. Is that a minute? Right. Is it 20 minutes? Right. Probably 20. So it's yeah, probably more like 
30. <laughs> I mean, and he, like it's I like said, house concert type of the situation. Okay. And he also, I mean, <coughs> so here's, here's a thought. Mm -hmm. If he's willing to donate his time like that, maybe at some future, future date, that could be um, a fundraiser kind of thing. It's exactly where I'm going. going to be he could be invited to come and listen. To come and listen. That's and, close to the and, I mean, and he's mm -hmm. That's really where it's at. When you look at it, you don't just go to clubs, you go to your friend groups and invite them in and maybe has some wine. And that's what uh, many of the, like, when Maureen ran the Long Mike House of the Arts, they would have house concerts. And we had concerts at the guy that owned, owned uh, the leaning tree, his house. Oh, yeah, yeah. He had all that Western stuff. When he went into his house, he didn't have any of the Western stuff. He had all European art, right? Oh, for <coughs> off the charts. I mean, wow. ten thousand dollar paintings. Yeah. Wow. So some type of like mini concert or something. Yeah, yeah. I think that would be yeah. a great idea. It's something to put out there on the maybe uh, to kick off the patrons. That might be a great idea. Yeah, that's that's he, he he wanted to know yeah. to settle on the date, and he he is um uh. I know him through his wife, through Questers, and he, 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 I mean, he's just, he's just but um, the fact that he'd be willing to donate it to the Callahan House because the Questers use it and all that other things, I think that, I think we just might need to tweak it for a different event. Mm -hmm. He's a piano player? He is a pianist, and a concert pianist, and he wow. has, Albums and he travels all over. Wow. So maybe another one kind of music. When you set up that committee meeting to talk about the patrons, maybe you revisit this and that. Absolutely. Yeah, so yeah. Kind of see if yeah. they think. But I'm glad, I'm glad you guys are kind of in the same room. Oh, yeah. That's so generous. Well, this, and yeah. I don't want to snub them. But, right. but, but it, it was they were work. served, I think, in yeah. the other functions. What's his name again? Um, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm terrible at names. Uh, it's not Fred. Yeah. Um, I can get you a Fred's Fred's the piano. Oh, it's great. Yeah. He's the piano. Yeah, he's the piano tuner. He's the piano. She can get that into it. I apologize. I'm no. terrible with names. No. I can't remember movie stars' names. Okay. Uh, anything else on that? Okay. Going to move to Art Walk. The only thing I have going for Art Rock right now is, again, I've got the music handled. Right. <laughs> so I have um, Sal Monterano is going to come with his, his um, quartet duo thing and, and play for us. He is very excited. He's also sharing us on his um, multimedia um, his page. page and everything. And he drew quite a crowd. He brought in a lot of people yeah. for Art Rock. Yes. So my big thing right now is to jump on getting artists. Okay. Um, we want to fill up the space with more than just five artists. We want to fill it up. Um, and from talking to Brittany, we would like to put more out, the garden, out the garden yeah. and, and span out. And I know uh, it is iffy with, um, I will, where is that water coming? Okay, just, no, it's the air conditioner. Air conditioner. I'm like, why is that noise? Okay. Sorry. Um, uh, I know September being iffy on weather, we'll have to work with that as we go. But um, yeah, so if anybody knows any artists. Art Walk is September? Yeah, 15th. And did the, the contact list from last year who was, who was in charge of? reaching out to those artists from last year. That was Anne. Anne did it last right, year. But, okay. I, but I'm taking over sure. on that. Okay. And, and I'm going to try to get a variety of different mediums. And I'm not going to just bring, I thought I would reach out to some of my other contacts from the, um, when I was on the Art Council and see if they, they would just do a demonstration even, of possibly, yeah. of, um, you know, across the board. Yes, we'll have some sales, but we don't do a tremendous amount of sales right now. Um, during that, but we did sell quite a bit of we did sell the pictures to the house and yeah. and books and other things. Yeah. So, and I see that we have books on on down here on a future. 
pictures. And the artist was out there painting as we speak and things. That worked out really nice. I, I, so I'm hoping um, that it will be similar. Yeah. But with more artists. So. Okay. So again, if you know any friends that are artists, say, please let me know. Ideas, you know. speak up. Please. Because I, the, this is not just me. I would take all the help I can get. You do have Anna's list. Yeah, I've got a partial list. Yeah. So I is thought that something I, Brittany would have had? No, it's a file that oh. Anna gave me. Oh, and okay. I, I've got the list, but we, we okay. had also decided that we didn't want to necessarily use um, okay. the, the one uh, place out on um, mm -hmm. yeah, my my gene. Gene. yeah, my yeah. Gene. It was mm -hmm. just too. Just, I loved it, but there was too much stuff. Too discombobulated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're gonna we're just the red trigger, the red. I want to say red door. 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 It's, it's not the red door. It's red, the red roof. Something. Red something. Yeah. I'm saying the red door. Which is I go in there and wander around. I know where it is, but I don't even know where it is. Okay. Anything else on our block? Okay. We're going to move into new business items from the staff. Brittany has nothing to to bring. Although I was wondering. Are we still chatting about the piano, or is that what did we take that off? Because it's just in the process. I just didn't see it here. So was that something we removed from the? I think yeah. it was in the process. It's it's yeah. 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 Okay, so we're just yeah. Cool. If anything, we'll move it up to old business just to update ourselves on what's going on. Mm -hmm. It feels like a million dollars for that. Yeah. Maybe at this point. Is it? No. Oh, I know. I'm like, what? what? I thought you cost that. Well, yeah. Okay, well, they do. It does. They do. Add up. It that seems so simple, and it isn't. Yeah, it's not. Yeah. It's, it's not going to be really nice. Yeah, so. I'm glad to love that one. That's great. Yeah, but, yeah. Okay, I'll put that on for old business for next month. Uh, anything else, Ben? Uh, nothing. Nothing. Really we're, I mean, all sorts of stuff going on. But right. You guys, uh, budget is our I don't know my big thing in the last month. We're kind of done. We have some budget meetings. There's uh, being told is beyond necessities, don't no project anything. I feel like okay. I've heard that before. So, um, that's how we're going to be able to ask uh, for level. We have level one and level two, so we ask for level one is things we can't control or. Cost of the world. And so we have some salary increases for the temp salaries that go back to the creation budget. Uh, actually, it doesn't affect Callahan budget itself. So uh, we feel pretty comfortable with Callahan, but it is, of course, we have the point to get in there. And that's the big question. That's are we asking for the, yeah, we're, asking. are we begging? We're begging for the money. I don't expect to get it, but is our begging point that's you got to keep there. begging. Okay, <laughs> And I have to explain it each each year. Right. right. What that means and what it is. Is it submitted now? Yeah, I think it's submitted in uh, May. Uh, early May for the CIP Brown projects. At the end of May for all the other stuff. So okay. um, there's a big priority with transportation and housing. Yeah. It's it's written in the in the um, chart of when the city manager has to receive the Budgets from each department. It's usually April. Uh, the end of the, the end, end of May, May yeah, is, the, is the final yeah. submission. We have our own time limits, obviously, to be able to get it up to January. Right. So, exactly. We are we are just we're hopeful of preparation um, to have some adjustments, and we're working on some other things with subsidy, which are actually filled the in a little bit. Um, I don't want to get too deep into that, um, especially on camera frame, but. Um, Kind of working on where our subsidy is with the recreation, making some adjustments there, how, how we pay for things, do some things that need to be subsidized, get our more community benefits. So we're working on some interesting things. I'll let you guys know. Okay. It's more yeah. it's interesting true. rather than yeah. kind of land, kind right. of thing. But exactly. the big thing is that we do the ask so then we can then put it back onto us to work 
on as a board to get grant funds. Correct. Yeah, and that means it shows yes, that it's in there and it's been in there consistently for five years, I think. Is it five or I think so? I think it is five. Three, but. You're, you're probably it's right. It's a lot. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, you get two years gone there. So, <laughs> so one way or the other, we'll work this out. I, okay, so it's been in there on a consistent basis. So, uh, and not getting approved. So I think it's one of those. You know, we can definitely we, want to be able to look out there and, and look and see what we can do. So. Maybe through the state or something. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay. Good to know. Thanks, Ben. Um, any items from the board? Well, mine actually goes to the Scammer uh, uh, County Book Rights reprint. Um, I have been working diligently to track down oh. her, and I even went to so far, even going to the um, her old homeowners association in the household. Um, to try to get a recent number or yeah. anything, they have had no luck. <coughs> mm. They Absolutely. hide really well. I, it, well, she unfortunately, I do know, went into a retirement home okay. that and is sense. under care of a nephew. And it's okay. a nephew seems to be under a separate name. Right. So, trying to track that without there's everything yeah. to do with confidentiality right. and, yeah. and privacy rights. So, uh, it is not looking good that we are going to be able to track down um, her specifically to get okay. the rights. Sometimes these things go out of rights. Um, my uncles were, were publishers, and uh, they would do uh, <clears throat> they would do reprints of, of books that had gone out of out of print. And they would buy those, and somewhere just because people would want uh, it, just like they would print it in the exact same format and, and bind it and everything uh, in the same format as something like Uncle Tom's Cab or something like this. It would look like an antique book, but it was brand new. And uh, so, somebody wanting to have something that looked like that in their library that looked antique ish with. Uh, and everything it had exactly that. That's what had. I wonder if you check a little further, maybe city uh, staff, specifically the uh, the, the legal department, would look copyright. into seeing if it was out of uh, uh, copyright. If it yeah. was, then there's no reason to bother with trying to chase it down. With exactly. Them. It would be so much easier. How How long has I hadn't even thought about that. I know, and we so talked about this, and I just literally this moment, not, not earlier, but that, so, I, it, it yeah. just kept, I don't know why, something Well, I just loaned, <laughs> I loaned my copy of the book to our neighbor, so I don't have that copy right now. Oh, we'll yeah. the copyrights. Yeah, I'm in so I might have taken it right now. But if, if somebody has uh, that copyright, yeah, but I don't know. that's it. That's a thing that that's an interesting point. Thank you, Sean. Because if we can go that direction, I it takes a whole lot. Well, if they they don't, no, I didn't care. realize it. They're, they're, they're not they're right. not making profit off this thing. This is not right. a thing. And right. the nephew, if he brings it up, would be on pretty shaky ground. Yeah. And I don't think he's going to come back and go. Oh my goodness! What? Yeah, I've got copyright on it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, there it is. So will this tell us anything? She she might might the page the first problem. page or two. Oh, 2001 copyright. 2001. Uh -huh. So it's 20, bet, 20 years. 20, 20 plus years. I don't know that it stays. I think there's a limit. Who would know the answer to that? Probably well, it says without limiting. We have attorneys that work, right. work for us. So. We can just submit a legal story and ask things like that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Without yeah. limiting the rights under copyright reserved above, no part of this publication may be reproduced, stored in, or introduced into the retrieval system or transmitted in any form or by any means, electronic, mechanical, photographic, <coughs> or otherwise, without the prior written permission 
of both the copyright owner and the above publisher of this book. But if you have tried to do your due diligence, then that sort of thing goes away. And in 20 years, I would bet that there's... Well, and we have done due diligence, and we yeah. also have had prior permission when she gave us the book. We did not send it. So we would have some legal footing, I would think, that we had permission. If oh, nothing else... I've done her to ask. If we done her to ask. If it doesn't work, then, then, then we could possibly add corrections because we already know there are certain things that are already quite awesome. correct. Yeah. No. Okay. She's not in the house anymore, is she? Yeah. She can't be Nope. It's been sold because it has been oh, addressed. It's been sold. I've tracked. I've tried to track her down every which way I can. What about is he printed in the system? And who printed that? It's Morel Graphics. Morel. Oh, they've been out of business for oh, um, okay. years. So there okay, you go. Okay, see, so you there's you can't. Some um, it's a bit possible to get the, that. Ah, so that's what would you look into that for us, Ben? Ben's going to check it. Okay, with the city. The right thing? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and Sean, you said you well, wanted yeah, to talk about... That is, uh, I'm from council. Um, last night, we had Sarah Leonard uh, visit Longmont uh, come in. <clears throat> On their slideshow, they talked about how they wanted to look at a cultural <coughs> um, aspect, particularly in last night's uh, meeting minutes uh, and on the live uh, thing for council. Uh, her presentation was there. So, my my thought is that uh, how we I know Maureen has said uh, talked about putting the QR codes in the in the in your in your uh, um, garden and on to the house. And if those could get printed and put on, then you'd have going to your patrons and donations that sort of thing. People clicking on those and realizing. That they can come in here, but if they knew as part of this alumni that you could go into the gardens and walk around the gardens, I mean, we just went to a place we didn't do anything other than read their QR codes literally in a area where they said this is where druids had built uh, uh, stuff. Uh, in a pretty, you know, uh, I would not say Ireland is as developed as the United States on that level of things, and and, and yet, that, that was there. And that was there. That was right there with a presentation and everything. And yeah. so the thing is, is that we certainly have the technology. I mean, we're one of the uh, highest, uh, we've got some of the highest population of technical, uh, uh, technologically, uh, you know, adept connected peoples. and adept yeah. uh, people uh, in the country. I would think that we'd be able to make some real headway if that, but making it clear. And I was going to also maybe talk to the folks over the, uh, Hover uh, uh, Manor. I mean, Hover so House. Saint Brain, um, for Saint because, Brain. you know, I don't think they're getting connected either. And if we could have groups that come in like they do for looking at uh, the Stanley and just, just kind of doing that type of thing, it's just, it would be so great for us. Well, we. We already know that Eric Mason does tours and stuff for the museum. He yes. does things through the, through the community. And we also have the um, East Side Historic Neighborhood that does walks and whatnot. Okay. But, Jacoby, Dr. Jacoby. Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. But the big thing is to make sure that the Visitors Association and them are all working together. And that's and what she wants disconnect. to do. So if she's asking for it, Let's give it to her. Yeah. Let's let's say here you go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And and Work with that, and, and art in public places was having these QR codes on different buildings and stuff like that too. Well, this is as artistic as you possibly can get in the form of a <laughs> advanced uh, 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 Victorian level garden, uh, or or I would think for this area of the country to think that this crop up here out of the blue and then the history of associated with how Callahan helped Penny and Penny helped Wall, uh, you know, uh, Sam Wall and others throughout time. That's that's pretty impressive that the pain it forward sort of mentality is is something that we can hang our hat on. Yeah, that's part of this history. Do you think she'd be interested in participating in 
the club affair? I think she would. I think it would just take an ask. What do you think? Can you Larry? remind me of who, is this the one that presented that you're asking yes. about? Yes, this is Sarah Leonard, and her, I've got her uh, email and everything, so. Yeah, and what is her, does she have a company? She's okay. with what is it's called Long Visit Longmont, okay. and so their email is uh, S Leonard, L-E-O-N-A-R-D, at symbol visit longmont.org. It's Sarah with an S A R A spelling, and their um, website is www.visitlongmont.org. And so I just thought of that and thought, wow, that is really such a connection. That, And when I saw her slide that said she wanted to make those sort of connections, I thought of you guys first. And so. Yeah. And that's one of the reasons I'm here today too, because I thought, I mean, she didn't. She and I hadn't had the chance to talk about about this at, uh, after last night's meeting, getting over around nine thirty, nine forty-five ish. Yeah, early. Yeah, yeah. 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 Which answer would you repeat her email? Yes, Leonard at visitwalmart.org. Is it Leonard? Item. Okay. I I couldn't read. Yeah, and I'm sorry. It's uh, I, I think need... it's probably on the website too. Yeah, we yeah, and it's, it and it's uh, L E O N A R D Leonard, and her first name spelling is S A R A, but it's S Leonard. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. That's something else. you reach out to her. When, uh, I've been yeah. Kind of waiting to hear. Yeah. For them getting going a little bit with her, because yeah. I was on the hiring group with her. I'm yeah. super, very impressed with her. And so, she's just new. And she, she's this, just this as of life. this week is a full year here. Yeah. 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 Is she the one from Alaska? Uh huh. Okay. And I'm not sure if Brittany has reached out to her before. You know, a couple of months ago, I feel like maybe it was before I went on maternity leave, so quite a while ago, we were talking about trying to make those connections. We, we had tried to, 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 I felt, I had mentioned that I thought mm -hmm. it was important that we. We work with the Visitors Association. Right. Yeah, that was because we did that for the last year. Okay, well, let's talk about that. People coming to Longmont and looking at various websites are going to get information about the Visitors Association. Yeah. 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 Yeah was talking about how those sort of things too. So they were there together giving, uh, uh, Aaron gave her presentation about the economic development of Mongwa and uh, how they talked about the recreation and they talked about, you know, uh, other aspects of Mongwa and then they talked about, uh, then um, Sarah did her presentation and that was kind of nice that, to see those two tied hand in hand because yes. they were just at the right time, especially for, than some of your goals. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cool. Yeah. So we'll revisit that. Anything else on any of those items from the board? Uh, future agenda items. We already visited the scan board. Uh, future restoration and preservation. I don't. When Brittany and I corresponded. She didn't have anything, and I didn't have anything. I, I think without Karen here. <laughs> well, I, I think, well, we do have that list. That yes. with the, our list or our ongoing list of things that we'd right. like to, to see. But I think the big thing with the future restoration and preservation, we need to be looking at grants. Um, particularly, Ben, thanks for the awareness that that has been listed for five years. So we have asked for money. We're going to get the money. 
So let's start looking and okay. start asking for somebody else for the money to, to work on the, the repointing. And then we can look at the other projects behind it because we do have an up and coming list of things that we would like to do. So I think we need to, to talk about putting it on the agenda. Did you say having someone else uh, provide the funding, like through a grant or something? Yes, I think we're going to have to look at, at uh, different avenues to get funding for them. We'll put that. Yeah, the the, the, the 3000 5000 10000 so stuff. You know, that's, that's, that's an area we have some flexibility in. Been doing, been doing things on a consistent basis, which is great. Um, but the items we talk about hundred or more, more thousand but, dollars. But we knew when we were going to ask for it that yeah. we were going to get turned down. I mean, really, well, technically, yeah. it was somewhat the, of the goal the, to prove that we've been doing the, this. The 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 manager, Harold, understands that, that. I mean, it has to get done. Yeah. There, there's a point; it has to get done. They yes. do recognize that, that, that this is not one of those. It's not a want; it's a need. We can't tell you. We can't tell you exactly when that need is, um, but you've been told there is a need. But Kevin looked at it; he agrees that it's time to do it. From what I know, that, that not necessarily this week or even next year, but it needs to get. It's time. Oh, but, it's time. But maybe so, we could find a similar thing in which um, we came up with funds with this estate. Exactly. Where we had to have a partnership between the city and, and the state to come up with money. Mm -hmm. So I think it needs to be put at least on the new business for, to, for discussion. Exactly. Okay. Again, this is not going to be an overnight fix. Yeah. Oh, if we just only have those lawns. I mean, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. And well, since we kept a lot of work its way out, but it's worked pretty much beyond that. Yeah. Okay, is there anything else anybody wants to bring up? Mm -hmm. yeah. I will entertain a motion for adjournment. Mm -hmm. that we adjourn? I'll send it. All in favor? Aye. 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 Aye.